How's it going, everyone? I'm Mortal Dragon Lord here, once again bringing you another Skyrim Special Edition Rare Guy. And I got a pretty cool weapon. Uh, I'm trying to use a different word other than cool this time. I got a pretty superb, let's say, looking weapon for you this time. It's, in terms of the type of weapon it is, definitely stronger than most of the other stuff I've shown in the past. This is a guide on how to acquire the unique glass blade, Grim Seven. Now this is a very awful glass weapon. If you played Oblivion, you've seen the glass weapons there. They were cool, but not something you want. But for me, at least, not, not something you want to use forever. But in Skyrim, the glass weapons have made a comeback and look so much better. Like something an elf or definitely royalty would use. Yeah, neat weapon. So, in order to acquire this weapon, two things you have to do, and uh, actually should have done, is take the helmet off my follower. I'm itching yeah. for a fight. No problem. I can carry a good bit of gear. We just do this for a bit. Because this this follower relates to the whole thing. All set. Let's go. So, in order to get Grimsev, what you first want to do is travel to Riften. Like, we stop at a gate, go off on your very first time. You have to get into all that, but uh, once you're inside Riften, you'll run into this person right here, Mayor the Lioness, speaking to someone named Aaron. So now, what you're gonna want to do is you want to talk to her, and I don't know, if it, I don't know if uh, this relates at all, but do it just in case. She'll talk to you about the thieves' guild and about how their methods are worse than the Dark Brotherhood, which, honestly, I consider thievery to be a much less crime than murder, but uh. Still a crime, nonetheless, but um, basically, for me, I agree with her and she respects you for that. And the next step is you want to be at least level 15 in order for you to get the option what happened to Grimsev. Because when you first meet her, she talked to you about how, she, about how she used to be an adventurer, and no, she didn't get an arrow in the knee like the guards do. I know what you guys are thinking, but. Uh, she, ran, she did run into an incident and she lost her blade. Uh, Grimstead was actually Mael's blade. But she's a two man weapon user, so it's a little interesting, ironic, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, she'll basically tell you that she lost it in a Dwemer Ruin. And after telling her you'll retrieve the blade, she will send you to, a, to the north to this Dwemer Ruin, Mazinchela. This, this is filled. This is a three-section dungeon. First section is filled with bandits and a couple Dwemer automatron. Second level, there may be one or two automatrons there, but it's mostly Falmer. And then the final level, you face a Dwarven Sphere and you also face a Dwarven Centurion. And in that section, after you kill the Centurion, it's the same Centurion that almost killed me all the first time. When you defeat the Centurion, You'll find Grimsever laying on, the on a table, not too far from where it was at. The weapon. When I was young, I journeyed with my father on hunting expeditions into Morrowind. The cliff racers made for excellent sport. Yeah, Mayo one of those uh, chatty followers, just so you know, just like uh, Arinder. But she's, but she's also essential. So that's actually a. That takes away from everything else. One of the, she's one of only several essential characters, followers in the entire game, so that's pretty neat. <clears throat> but yeah, but once you get Grim Server, it'll still be a quest item. So what you want to do is you want to return it to Mail in Riften. The weapon will no longer be a quest item, and you can take it back if you want afterwards. And Mail becomes a father. So I traded Arinder in for her and gave her some Daedra Garment to wear, and that's that. This is what she looks like. Face wise, because you guys want to get a good look at her. No problem. I can carry a good bit of gear. And I'm gonna give her her helmet back because it doesn't look quite the same without the helmet. I'm wearing a There we are. All set. Let's go. Anyway, so yeah, once you've got the Grim Sever, once you've done that, Grim Sever is yours. <clears throat> As you can see, it is a glass sword.
try and get a couple different angles for you guys as well. And then it's in chat. Target takes 15 points of frost damage to health and stamina. So the Oaken and a Doge video I did last time, this is the same exact gem, except the difference is this is a glass weapon, and it's 15 points of frost damage instead of 10. Making it more nifty to have than other items. Yeah. God might get nervous. A man approaches with his weapon drawn. <laughs> I'm like the honey badger. I don't give a shit. Hey, watch it. <laughs> Alright, so once. So that's it for the enchantment. It's a pretty neat enchantment. Common enchantment, but it fits the sword. <clears throat> and then what you want to do is you want to go to a grindstone. <clears throat> and with a max skill of 100 in smithing, and with a refined malachite, you can improve the. You can improve Grim Seven to Legendary. I already did so. So there's no point for me to show it, but... Well, you basically pretty much make the weapon stronger than it is. You know, same old, same old. <laughs> Divine smile on you, friend. And that... That does it for this video. Thank you all for watching. Please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe if you find it helpful, or if you enjoyed it at all. And, uh... Wait, why is it... Oh, it's almost dawn. <laughs> First time that's happened in a video. When I'm recording, and it's actually it's morning in the game. Well, it's starting to become morning, but uh, not one. But uh, yeah, so I'll make sure to bring you guys more guides as soon as possible. I'm narrowing down my choices for the next day's request, and I think I've actually made the official decision what I'm going to do next. And you guys are going to like it, to say the least. I, I know I did, and you'll you'll like it too. Just enough said about that. So that said, thank you all for watching once again. If you do, do take care. <laughs>